Hi guys, welcome back to the workshop. Uh, we're now on take three for doing this video. This will hopefully be the first little uh, build series of what's in this box here. I can't tell you what that is until he's seen it, but hopefully on the thumbnail you'll know what's in here. Um, I said this is the first video in this little series. It's also the first video we're doing uh, of uh, this in this workshop. As you can see, it's not fully finished yet. Um, we're still working on it, um, but I'll put a link up here somewhere to all the other videos that we're doing for fitting out the workshop. But this video is about unboxing what's in this. Um, I've hopefully got two different camera angles on this, which I should be able to switch between the two to give you more details of what we're doing. So Ewan, start opening that at that end. Okay. Now, this um, is something that's been around for a little while. Um, cracking little design. Um, there's a few aircraft from the same uh, supplier. Um, I believe all designed by the same guy. Uh, Ewan hasn't got a clue what this is. Uh, it's a surprise for him. Um, and it's going to be his because I've bought his sister something else. Um, but this is literally a surprise unboxing. He hasn't got a clue what it is. So if you can gently take out everything that's in there. What have we got? Some sort of model. It's some sort of model. Right, is that everything out of the box? No. Right, get everything out of the box. Everything out of the box. What suckers? Go on, everything out of the box. Is that everything? Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. Right, so. As it says here, this is the Angel Wings Designs, damn it. You might be able to see that there a bit better. Now, these decals, the first thing I'm seeing, we've got decals here. No, don't throw them out. These are all part of the design, Ewan. Oh. Yeah. So if you look, these are all on the wings. Yeah, so we've got decals, which Andy supplied. Andy, uh, thank you very much for these. So there's a couple of different ones here. So we've got what looks like white on black or black on white and we've got a white one as well. So it might be a layup you have to do, which isn't a problem. And then this is the kit. So I'm actually gonna take the knife this time just so you don't damage anything. First thing we've got, this is the whole kit. This is everything that's in it. Um, these bits were a bit of an additional bit that I bought, stroke given, stroke got cheaply from Andy. Um, but this is what you'd get in the Dammit kit, I believe. Um, is it a glider? As far as I'm aware, no, it's not a glider. There is a glider version called the Dammit S. This is the Dammit E. What does E stand for? Uh -uh. Electric? Oh. So two bits of, I'm guessing that's eight millimeter down. I know they're gonna be the leading edge. Little hardware pack here. That's got some. Well, that's nice. I like that. You see, these horns, control horns. Yeah. 3D printed. Um, there's some push rods in there. A magnet, which I'm guessing is for the hatch. Some screws. So everything's needed there. The hardware. And this is where it gets interesting. First of all, trying to get into the pack. Andy, first of all, if you're watching this, thank you very much. Lovely colour of bubble wrap. And Martin, if you're watching this, you need to get onto the pink bubble wrap. So, I don't know how well you're going to see it on this bubble wrap, but this is all laser cut. What do you think, just looking at it straight away? I don't know. You don't know? I think that is very nice, very nicely done. So we've got some control horns in there as well. I wonder why we've got two sets of control horns. I'm a bit confused now. Anyway, right, so again, you should be able to see in that camera a bit better. That's a hatch, control horns. That'll be a fin and fin, I think. It's all very nicely laser cut. This, look how thin that is. You even get laser cut sheeting for the wing. That's more laser cut sheeting. That is the 
trailing edge, I believe. Again, all laser cut with the right angles on it, or correct angles. This is more sheeting. So that's very, very nicely cut. Uh, motor mount, there's actually two in here. Oh, I know what it might be. There's two points, isn't there? What? There's a two point. I don't think so, no. So that's three millimeter, three millimeter birch um, for the motor mount. This is an electric model. You've got that area which you actually glue into the front of the fuselage. And this is what you actually screw the motor to. Now, I actually mentioned to Andy before I bought this that somebody had a little Cox engine, now a Cox 049. We might be able to do a dual fuselage one, one with a Cox engine and one with electric. So it's motor mount. And then we've got some very, very nice lightweight ribs. Very nice. They are very nicely cut out there. That's out of 3mm light ply or poplar ply. More ribs, tips. Not sure. That's going to be a fuselage former of some sort. And then we've got spar, fuselage sides. Those are very small fuselage sides. It's a small aeroplane, you I don't know how small it is. That big. Um, so that's the spar, fuselage sides. Can't remember what those bits are. But I'm sure it'll become apparent. And last but not least, on what looks like that's going to be yeah. 332, sorry, 532. It's not quite quarter, so that's going to be like 5 mil balsa. You've got some elevons. So that is the complete kit. Um, very, very nicely presented, if you ask me. And it should be a relatively quick build as well. Just trying to lay it all out so I can see it all here. So you've got lots of ribs. This is particularly nice. There's not many kits I've seen do this. We've actually got pre-cut sheeting. And that's on 16th balsa. So yeah, you didn't know this was coming, did you? No. And you didn't know it was going to be for you either, did you? No. Well, it is. I don't know, I've never even heard of one. Well, I can show you videos later on. But this is our kit to build. So that is the complete kit there. Uh, a few little additional pieces which I've got to experiment with. Um, but yeah, quite impressed with that. Um, value for money, that's, I think, taking out the decals. Certainly those ones, I'm not sure if these ones are in the kit. But taking out those ones, everything you see here is 45 quid at the time of filming. Um, I'll put a link below to where they can be bought from. I'm not on commission. I'm not subsidised. I'm not sponsored by Angel Wings. I just like their aeroplanes. Um, and I thought it'd be nice for Ewan to have this aeroplane, which he can build, he can fly, and he can crash when he wants to. So It's probably this going to be you that crashes it when you want to turn it. This is... <laughs> this is just an unboxing, a quick look at the kit. Um, any questions, any comments, please put it below. Um, I'm looking forward to building this. Not sure when we're going to start building it, because we're at the minute we're on a pop-up table. We're not on a building bench. This table is not square, it's not flat, it's not true. But we have got another big bench over there, which we might be able to clear enough space on to start building this. Um, yeah, quite pleased with this kit. So if you can check out our videos uh, for this build, um, there'll be a link up here to this build series as it happens. Um, if you're liking what we do, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, uh, and as I said, comment below, they're always read and uh, answered. Um, but for now, from Ewan and from me, I'm Nick Reeves, and this is our hobbies.